Okay, so in this question, we're given coordinate D, which is right here, and coordinate E, which is right here. We know that coordinate D is located at negative 1, negative 1, so that's x, y, okay, we have to write it in the correct order, and E is located at 9 something. We don't know the y value of the second coordinate, right? But what we do know is this. What does this represent? What's m? So we know that the slope is equal to 1 over 2. So the rise is 1 and the run is 2. We have to find the missing y value. That's what this question is asking us to determine, okay? Okay, we know that slope is equal to, what's the slope formula? y2 minus over. Okay, so let's label our coordinates first. Which one do you want to call coordinate 1 and which one would you like to call coordinate 2? So we're going to call d coordinate 1. So x1, y1, and e, x2, y2. So what are we trying to find? What's the missing value? K, which we labeled as y2, right? We know m, and we know part of the coordinate of E, and we know all of coordinate D. So what do you think we should do with that information? Yes. We know what M represents. We know that the slope of this line is 1 over 2. So instead of writing M, I'm going to write 1 over 2. That's M. That's the slope, right? Okay, so slope is equal to, well, what did I label as Y2? What's my Y2 coordinate? K. And what's, so that's y2, take away, what do we label as y1, Ivan? What's y1? Good. So the formula is y2, take away y1 over, what's x2? 9. Take away x1, what's x1? Negative 1. Okay, we need to isolate k now. This is... I have 1 over 2 equals, let's simplify, simplify this. k take away negative 1 becomes k, a negative and a negative makes a plus 1. And we have 9 take away negative 1. That becomes 9 plus 1. What's 9 plus 1? 10. Okay? That's all we can do right now. I can't add k plus 1 together, can I? No, they're not like terms. We're trying to undo this divided by 10, so we're going to multiply by 10 to reduce that to 1. That's gone. What do I have to do to the left side? Multiply by 10. What's 10 times a half? 5. Good. So I'm going to write this over here because I'm running out of space. So 5 is equal to k plus 1, right? That's all I have left. k plus 1 and 10 over 2. 10 divided by 2 is 5. If 5 is equal to k plus 1... What is k equal to? k is equal to 4.